Hi YouTube, this is Gaming at Old School bringing you my first video. Um, I decided to do a collection video of my Nintendo 64 games um, since that's what I have the most of. And I've been collecting for a little, probably four and a half, five months. So um, yeah, I just wanted to get a video up when I started YouTube of my 64 collection so I could see how it's grown uh, throughout time. So um, I'll give a little bit of explanation on some games, not all of them, uh, just to save on time and let's get started so to start off we have the legend of zelda ocarina of time the legend of zelda ocarina of time collector's edition um, it is a great game they uh... the overall quality of this game was quite surprising at the time and it was just really well thought out and, and well developed um, we have the legend of zelda majora's mask the holographic collector's edition um, another great game I have Mario Party 1, Mario Party 2, and Mario Party 3. Mario Party 2 is my favorite out of the Nintendo 64 ones. Mario Party 3 is by far one of the worst of all the Mario Party series. They did not do a very good job on that. Um, we have Paper Mario, Mario Kart 64, uh, best racer on the system. We have Super Smash Bros. It speaks for itself. It's not nearly as good as the... Uh, sequels to the game, but it, great great start to the um, to the the series. We have Super Mario 64, Doctor Mario 64, Mario Tennis, which was a fun game. We have Mario Golf, which I didn't care for too much on the 64, but on GameCube it's fantastic. I have Toy Story 2, <coughs> not as good as Toy Story 1. Uh, Mission Impossible. We have Rugrats in Paris. Uh, Chameleon Twist, Chopper Attack, Pilot Wing 64, Army Men Air Combat. Um, that's my only Army Man game. I need to get uh, the others in the, the the series, like Sarge's War, Sarge's War 2. Those are fun games. Um, I have Killer Instinct Gold and another fighter, Clay Fighter 63 and one third. Um, still need to get sculptor cuts for that. Um, I have all the Pokemon games. I have Pokemon Stadium. Pokemon Stadium 2, which this game is um, gold and silver cart. Um, kind of cool. Unique. <clears throat> I have Pokemon Snap, which is my buddy's favorite game, but... Uh, <laughs> uh, yeah, it's okay. Pokemon Puzzle League. This game is insanely hard. I beat the game, and then when you beat it and the credits roll through, it says you've unlocked a super hard difficulty. So I try that, and it's pretty much death. It's hard to beat. I have not destroyed this game yet, but in due time, I will, as I always do. Um, the last Pokemon game is Hey You Pikachu. This game is terrible. They only made it uh, as a sales pitch to sell more, uh, you know, Pokemon stuff. So it worked. They bought it. You know, customers bought it, but it's a terrible game, so don't waste your money unless you're collecting to complete the collection. We have GoldenEye 007, awesome shooter, made us what we are today. 007, The World is Not Enough, that is a sweet game. Um, didn't get as, it wasn't as popular as GoldenEye, but a group of my friends and I, we had a blast with it. Um, I have all the Star Wars games for Nintendo 64, so I have Star Wars Shadows of the Empire, Star Wars Episode One: Battle for Naboo, Star Wars Rogue Squadron, and Star Wars Episode One Racer. Um, none of them are fantastic, but Episode One Racer, which probably has the least monetary value, um, is actually my favorite out of all of them. Um, I thought it was, you know, it's a fun racer. Uh, we have Donkey Kong 64, Banjo-Kazooie, addicting game, super fun, super crazy. Um, I didn't get to beat it, but I will go through and, uh, you know, destroy that later on. Uh, Banjo-Tooie. Um, I didn't play that growing up because I never had it. So once Banjo-Kazooie um, is out of the way, I will go ahead and move on to the sequel. Yoshi's Story, uh, super fun Yoshi game. We got the Turok games. So we have Turok Dinosaur Hunter, Turok 2 Seeds of Evil in the gray cart, Turok 2 Seeds of Evil in the black cart. Um, when I first started collecting, I was collecting the different variations of the same game, such as... Um, player's choice and you know if, if like the rating changed like if it was rated e and but when it was first released it was rated k through a i would collect that too but it just got too tedious and 
Um, as long as I have one copy of the game, I'm fine. But I did want to hang on to uh, the same game if it came in different colors. So, uh, Power Rangers Light Speed Rescue, enough said. South Park, Disney's Tarzan, not a very fun game. We have War Gods and Dual Heroes, which is a lame ripoff of the Power Rangers, but equally as bad. So, okay, we have F Zero X, which is a really, really great racer game. There was quite a few, uh, you know, racers that I liked for this this platform. Star Wars or Star Fox sixty four. This was my first uh, Nintendo sixty four game. We got it for Christmas when we got our system, and it is a blast. I remember um, w when I beat it. I, you know, the credits were rolling and I was running around the house telling my family how happy I was and just kind of going crazy like a, you know, 11 year old would, um, because, you know, I put Andros in his place and, uh, just restored peace to the Lilat system. So, uh, we have Charlie Blast Territory, Hercules, The Legendary Journeys, pathetic, Xena, Warrior Princess, The Talesman of Fate, equally pathetic. We have Castlevania. Mace the Dark Age, which is like a Mortal Kombat game. Um, it's really bad. I'm never, I haven't really ever been into, um, you know, the the one on one fighting like that. But I've played Mortal Kombat, and this is not nearly as good. We have Jet Force Gemini. That's a great game. Road Rash sixty four. Um, it's kind of corny here and there, but it is a lot of fun and addicting. Graphics are pretty bad though. <clears throat> um, San Francisco Rush Extreme Racing we have Rave Wa Wave Race 64 Lego Racers Off-Road Challenge Monster Truck Madness we have Diddy Kong Racing we have Excite Bike 64 all the Tony Hawks in the series Tony Hawk Pro Skater Tony Hawk Pro Skater 2 Tony Hawk Pro Skater 3 this one was the last game uh, released for the Nintendo 64 so um, yeah, just a little bit of knowledge for you. Uh, Rampage World Tour, Rampage 2, Universal Tour, both fun games. We have Battle Tanks and Battle Tanks Global Assault. Global Assault was much better, I thought. Um, really the same game, but, but they did a, a better, you know, out, outlay of the levels and stuff. Conquer's Bad Fur Day. It's popular. Um, a lot of people like it. I don't care for it that much. Um, I've never really gone through it, so maybe I'll have to do that. Uh, but, yeah, got that one. Quake 2, Bio Freaks. Now we're getting into some of the, you know, bad games, so we can go a little quicker. Um, Arrow Fighters Assault, Flying Dragon, Resident Evil 2, the only Resident Evil on the series, uh, on the, the 64. Gek 64, Enter the Gecko. We have Glover, Duke Nukem 64, Duke Nukem Zero Hour, Vigilante 8, and I have Vigilante 8, Second Attack, Bomberman 64, Bomberman 64, The Second Attack. This one's pretty rare. Um, it's hard to find. It's a, about a $50 game on eBay. I was able to pick it up for $15 on Craigslist. Um, it was in pretty bad shape, though. Uh, I, I, took, I took these screws out and um, took it apart, and the metal casing inside the, the cart was all rusted and stuff, so it had some water damage. I replaced the casing with a new, with a, you know, a different game. Um, so that's, I cleaned it all up nice and it works great, but there's um, a little bit of water damage on the, uh, on the label, but 15 bucks, you can't complain. Um, I have 1080 snowboarding, Twisted Edge Extreme snowboarding, Hydro Thunder, awesome racer. Um, you're, it, well, it's a boat obviously, but it is a lot of fun, arcade style. You have F1 Pole Position, 64, Hot Wheels Turbo Racing, MRC Multi Racing Championship, Extreme G64, Cruisin' USA, Cruisin' World. I still need to get Cruisin' Exotic, uh, so that's one that I need. We have Weilani Country Club True Golf Classics. This game is pathetic. <clears throat> Going through some all the sports games right now. NFL Quarterback Club, 99. Wayne Gretzky, 3D Hockey, NBA Courtside, Kobe Bryant and NBA Courtside, NBA Courtside 2 featuring Kobe Bryant, Triple Play 2000, NBA Showtime, NBA on NBC, Fox Sports College Hoops, 99, NFL Quarterback Club 2000, Madden 64, 
Madden 99, FIFA Soccer 64, we have NASCAR 99, Wayne Gretzky 3D Hockey 98, NBA Live 2000, WWF Warzone, all these wrestling games, WWF Attitude, WCW vs. NWO World Tour, WCW NWO Revenge, Backstage Assault, WrestleMania 2000, uh, Mayhem, we have Knockout Kings 2000, Nagano Winter Olympics 98, NFL Blitz 2000. The Blitz series is a really good series, um, a lot of fun, different spin on football. Um, but I like the original the best, NFL Blitz. It's a great game. Uh, Ken Griffey Jr. Slugfest, Major League Baseball featuring Ken Griffey Jr. In the Zone, 98. International Superstar Soccer, 64. And NBA Hang Time. <coughs> so that is my collection, um, as it's all a mess now. But I uh, just thought I'd you know, show you what I had, and there's still a lot that I have to get. Um, but I think for four and a half months, it's, you know, mighty fine. So, uh, yeah, be sure to subscribe because I'm going to have a lot of videos coming up and, uh, leave me feedback. Let me know what I can improve on. And, uh, if you have any requests for videos, uh, let me know that also. Um, okay. Have a great day.